refinery so you could drive your cars. The schools, the parks, the storm drains so you don't get flooded or made by construction workers. The sewer lines so you can do what you gotta do. The rails, the bridges. All the buildings where you work are built by construction workers. But we need jobs to feed our families. We need your support to support this project. Let's get it done. My name is Andrew Yorga. I'm a member of Labor's Local 507. Uh, you know, I've heard a lot said here, especially by those of you that live in the city and the community. Uh, a lot of my members do, or our members. Um, you guys should probably want this. Mm -hmm. It says it all. I mean, when we lived in Long, or when we bought in Long Beach, we knew Long Beach was dirty. We knew it was in Yellowstone. And now the port is trying to take us forward or into the future, like the gentleman said earlier, and we're still opposing it. LNG was brought up years ago, was shot down. These are projects that were that are going to clean the air, that are going to allow your children, our children. I just had a children, my, a child myself, to grow up in a cleaner environment. It ain't going to happen overnight. It's going to take time. It's going to take years. Other ports are already there. Obviously, we can't do that yet. Um, Long Beach is a big economic engine right next to LA. A lot of imports come through this area. And it's never going to stop. It's only going to say we don't need a project like this. But ask one of our, our members that is losing their house or they can't send their kids to school with food. Or it, it's very tough right now. It's almost scary, but it's a time. If you're not in those shoes, you don't know what it's like. And I'm around it every day. And it's very hard. When someone comes along with a project of this magnitude to help us out and our members, for all the community, Everybody's I think we should be behind them 100%. Yeah, you didn't wait up down harvest. If you don't have any truck driver employees, supposedly, that 800 trucks, 600 trucks at times, maybe 20 or 30, supposedly, drivers. Um, the other company that's made 143 drivers on what, 20 acres? Employees?